Hi, welcome back to the Mind Body Project. Welcome back to day number four we're on now. So we're looking at 20 transforming concepts to challenge your limiting decisions, limiting beliefs, limiting thinking um, to help you grow and help you uh, challenge yourself. So number four, it takes 11 inputs of positive suggestions to overcome one negative suggestion. And that's coming from Albert Einstein. Now, although that's not necessarily true, because it depends on tonality and depends on what beliefs a person has about what's suggested, um, just imagine that is true for a sec, because here's what happens. So what I call is this is the brain bucket, yeah? Now, this brain bucket, if you think about it this way, what percentage of negative suggestions get put into your head each day compared to positive? Is it 50-50? Is it 90-100 uh, positive towards positive suggestions? Or 90 to, uh, uh, sorry, 90 to 10? Um, positive or 90 to 10 negative suggestions uh, what would you say that is for you currently because if you if you listen to things like the news the news is like near enough a hundred percent negativity and it, there is a lot of suggestions and a lot of hypnotic language that's used there yeah it's before before I done my hypnotherapy course I didn't realize that there's so many negative suggestions and things they put into your head that you assume are true, but they're not necessarily true. They're not saying any of it's true because they cover themselves because they could be sued. So there's words that they use to make sure that, they, that they're not saying it's true. They're saying it just could be true. Yeah, but that's going into your head and bypassing your conscious mind, going straight into your unconscious mind. Um, People around you, they're toxic people around you. Are they talking to you, saying, belittling you or saying things down to you? Or do you have empowering people around you in your environment? Do you go to uh, a place or a workplace where you've got empowering people? And what you want to do is try and come up with a, um, and just think about how, what is it positive and negative? And most people, it's probably about maybe five to 10% positive. And about 90% negative. And what that's doing is that's conditioning you. That's conditioning you and it's affecting your decision making because it's affecting your state. It's affecting your conditioning, it's affecting your state, and it's affecting your productivity, and it's affecting your performance and how you feel. It's dragging you down. And you've got to be aware of that. So how would you transform that around? So the first thing is you get rid of toxic people out of your life. That's the first thing. Switch off the news. And then what you do is you replace it with... Um, personal development audios or motivational speakers. Uh, listen to them, learning, read a book, uh, go and talk to or surround yourself with people who are really empowering, who really talk, uh, make you feel good. That's what you wanna do because then that's gonna affect your decision making. And you, the, the when you feel good, you make good decisions. When you feel bad, you make bad decisions. Yeah, which leads to bad things happening. So which one of those you've got to choose? And it all starts with what's going in to your brain bucket.